Hey, what's going on LinkedIn? Daryl Hamill with Hamill Media. And today I'm going to answer one of the most frequently asked questions I get asked by people I know. And that is, for most salespeople, whether they're in real estate, auto sales, um, they're in medical sales, they are using their phones to post videos online. And they ask, hey man, I wanna up my game. What camera do you suggest? I'm ready to go to the next level right? So they're using like an iPhone 7, a Google Pixel, something along those lines. Sure, I could say maybe you go with a dedicated camcorder, something you could flip the screen around and you can talk into that, right? Something like this. Or maybe something along the lines of professional YouTube vloggers, like a nice DSLR or mirrorless camera like this, where you can hold it out and talk. But it's not the camera that can significantly impact your video that you put online. Because the truth is most cell phones have pretty fantastic cameras. If you have something like a Google Pixel 2 or even the iPhone 7, the Pixel 3 or you know the iPhone 11, which they're just amazing, it's not the camera really that's gonna up the game. Believe it or not, it's your audio. And I'll give you a perfect example. This whole time I've been talking on a wireless lavalier system that I've been tapping into this, into uh, an external recorder, because I wanted to be able to have the audio from the camera. So let's flip that audio over really quick to the camera I'm shooting on. Okay, so now this is the audio from the camera that I'm recording with. Now granted, it's a good distance away, but you can definitely hear a difference in the audio. And regardless of the video, it just makes it a lot less pleasing. All right, enough of that. Let's switch back to this audio now. Okay, so let's do an example with a cell phone. Let's upgrade the audio. Okay, well, how do we do that? Well, first and foremost, I think most people, if you really want to get, you know, if you want to up your game and you don't want to just com completely go around holding your cell phone like this all the time, if you're really serious about it, I usually suggest getting like a Joby or some kind of like a little tripod holder you can get that's gonna hold your cell phone. That way you can hold it up like this, right? And you can even adjust it. You can get some pretty cool angles and you can go around, you can hold it like this and you don't have that whole like selfie look. Now you're looking at it like this, which is more natural. With this also, I like this because now we can use what's called the shotgun mic. This is a Rode Video Mic Go. It's, I think it goes for about 60 bucks, uh, 100 bucks right now. I mean, considering the price of a camera. And with a lot of these stands like this, a lot of these cell phone mounts that go on tripods, you can simply mount what's called a cold shoe, cold shoe mount right on top. And now you have this vlogging setup with your cell phone, which is going to give you significantly better audio. And if you wanna use something like this on your cell phone, for example, like if you have the iPhone, most likely you're gonna need a dongle if you're going with the, yeah, even the seven doesn't have a, high, a headphone jack. So if you're going with the seven, anything newer than I think the six, you're gonna need the dongle. So you're gonna need a dongle, something you can plug this in because you don't have a headphone jack. And with some of these microphones, you may need what's called a TRRS to TRS converter. And what that simply does is allow you to hook in a microphone into your headphone microphone jack on your phone. So now I got this right here. This cable is about 15 bucks, maybe 10 bucks. And then you have the microphone, which is 60 to 100 bucks. For a lot less than you'd spend on a new camera, you have this increased audio. So you know what? Let's have an example and see how different the audio sounds. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna start up the camera app in here. And I'm, I'm just gonna have the regular microphone, I'm gonna use the regular camera app in the iPhone, right? Just going right to the home screen and going right into it. And so let's go ahead and record on this. So this is me using the regular built-in iPhone camera app and using the microphone that's built right into the iPhone. And this is how it sounds. Now let's plug in the shotgun microphone. And now let's see how that video sounds in comparison. Okay, so here we go. We have the shotgun microphone mounted on top using the exact same camera, everything the same as before, the native camera app, but now we have the Rode microphone hooked up as opposed to the internal microphone of the camera uh, or of the cell phone. 
So let's see how that sounds. And this is gonna sound a lot better than it did previously. Let's even try a more advanced one. Now this is significantly more money. This is, I wanna say 350 bucks. Um, you don't, you definitely don't need to go anything this advanced. And now let's go ahead and record with a higher end microphone. Okay, now we're listening to a more expensive, a more advanced microphone. And whenever you're speaking into your camera phone, always make sure you look at the camera itself so that it looks like you're talking to the people. But this is a, you know, this is a $350 microphone as opposed to a 60 or $100 microphone, depending on, you know, any sale that I got going on. But both are going to be significantly better than the microphone that's built into your phone. When you're considering whether or not you should upgrade your camera when you post videos online, I would highly suggest looking at your video and seeing how good it is. If the video is coming out good, you don't need to upgrade your video. But there's a good chance that if you're using the microphone that's built into your cell phone, your best upgrade could be going to a $60, $100, you know, a more advanced shotgun microphone to enhance that audio. That's what's really gonna give you the best bang for your buck and your online video. This is Daryl Hamill with Hamill Media, and I hope you find, found this helpful. If you have any questions about microphones or cell phones or inputs, anything like that, go ahead and leave some comments below and I'll be more than happy to answer them.